it's it's four o'clock in the morning. It's four oh five a.m. And provolone is seventy calories a slice. Life can fuck off, you know. I like just naturally being a fucking creep. I I want to film like a get ready with me video because I have a tattoo appointment today, so I'm gonna be like either on the road or there for a lot of the day. Guys, it's so fucking hot outside. It's 90 degrees. And my little tiny broke down should be replaced. Absolutely. Especially with my lung condition. AC unit is fighting the good fight. She's trying her hardest and she's, she's failing miserably. I don't want to talk shit about her because I'm afraid she's actually going to shut down. Um, and everybody's always telling me like, Shay, just leave the damn AC on, it's fine. Like, we'll deal with the audio, just leave the AC on. It bothers me. I know that everybody's always like, don't worry about it, but it bothers me. And I'm sitting here like, how am I gonna sit here and film for like two hours straight? Possibly three, depending on how much I fuck off without the AC on. Because this room heats up very, very badly. I'm already sweating. I'm already sweating really bad. I just found little like pieces of my breakfast in my teeth. I had this feeling when I got out of the shower that I should brush my teeth again, but then I had to fight it because I was like, no, over brushing your teeth is bad for your teeth. Maybe it was my fucking brain being like, hey, stupid. Also, I just realized my camera's on the lowest setting, which is so which is so awesome. I'm very excited about that. Um, I have a lot to do. No desire to do any of it. Let's start with our skincare, mostly because that's where I start. That's the first step. Let's start with the first step that we always do first. I also need to go to the grocery store before my appointment. I need to not think of all the things that I need to do and get overwhelmed and cry. I will, that's the thing. Why is there hair on everything all the time? I have three hairs on my fucking head at any given moment. That's a, that's when, that's, that's a good day for me when my alopecia is not being a fucking prick. I, why is there always hair on things? I don't have any hair. I cannot afford this. Why is it always happening? Anyways, I, I opened the lid on this and there was a hair and there's a hair right there. It just makes me want to slap myself. It makes me want to rip my my skin off. Um. Anyways, I got more test results from the blood work that I had done on Friday. Like right after I got finished with my vlog yesterday, I got more of my test results back. Guys, my hormones are effing me in the A. <laughs> my hormones are destroying my fucking life. Um, am I relieved to see these things? to know that I'm not fucking crazy. Uh, I am crazy, first of all, but um, yeah, I mean, it explains a lot. It explains a lot and Epps is trying to make me feel better about it. Like, yeah, now that we, you know, have proof in writing, they took your fucking blood from it. We can, you know, get on the path to you feeling better because guys, I feel like absolute trash. It has been weeks and weeks and weeks of me struggling to get out of bed and having anxiety that's so bad that like I throw up, which is just like the best. It's not the best. I 10 out of 10 would not fucking recommend it. My whole life I've been very, very anxious, but I've never like thrown up from anxiety until recently. I usually just get very angry and agitated from it. Like it was so bad for a second there. I was like, am I fucking pregnant? Like the nausea that would hit me out of nowhere. I was like, am I fucking Pregnant? Tubes are tied. I'm on birth control pills for the hormones, but I'm like, am I pregnant? <laughs> Get a fucking grip. Me when I'm paranoid, delusional, and that's all part of being a schizo, but still. You know what it feels like to have a to have a, a, a baby move in your body? If you've ever been pregnant, you know what it feels like to have a, a, an infant moving in your body. It feels like your organs are shifting. Like if you've ever had like that fluttery feeling where your organs are shifting, that's what it feels like. And every time I feel that, I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> I'm like, oh my 
my god because listen there used to be this show on uh discovery health which i don't even know if that exists anymore because i don't fucking have cable um called i didn't know i was pregnant and i'm like bitch mm, you fucking better not not only that i have a cousin that whose tubes were fucking tied fried and laid to the side just like mine and after she had two kids and guess what she now has a third child walking around so that's all every time i'm nauseous i'm like oh my god Every time my, my organs like violently shift because I'm lactose intolerant and ignore it. I'm lactose intolerant like 65% of the fucking planet. I'll eat like pizza and my organs will be like not happy with me. And I'm like, hello? I... Can you hear my stomach growl? I haven't eaten since I had my provolone quesadilla at four o'clock in the morning. I turned on a second light because I need to be able to see the texture of my skin and it's so fucking bright. I need your ass to calm down. Did you guys know that green eyes don't have any natural protection from light? So let's just blast uh, bright lights into my eyes. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't know that until I went to an eye specialist and they were like, yeah, you don't have any protection from the sun. So I suggest you stay fucking out of bright light. And when you go outside, you wear some fucking sunglasses because that shit's just blasting right in there. <laughs> I don't know if I can leave it on. I changed it to be warmer, hoping that that would help. It did not. Oh, that was a terrible idea. Why did you let me do that? But at least I know where that little light is now. At least I know where the little son of a fucker is. This is what I mean when I say that, like, if I if I don't listen to music and do my makeup, or do my makeup while I'm listening to music, I fuck off really badly. Like, I can literally sit here and just mess with things. I'm like, it's like whenever you clean your room and you just find things, and you're and, and maybe it's like something that you haven't seen in a long time, and suddenly you're distracted by it, and suddenly it's like it's brand new, and it's like the coolest thing you've ever seen in your life all over again. Also, don't pay attention to my nails. I have to do them today. I will do them today. I will do them today. They will be done today. I'm gonna do them today. I just put on my Lottie Bubble Tea Primer. Nasty bitch. It's a good primer. I just don't like looking at it. I'm trying to think how much I want to put this stuff on. Now that I've touched it, I'm going to put it on because I'm not gonna waste it. It's the Elf primer putty blah, 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 blah. i can't remember the fucking name of it matte putty primer that was that was close enough just in the t-zone just in the t-zone pat it don't rub it fee, 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 fee. you hear it all the time unless this is your first video of mine in which case um i'm sorry it's a rude introduction i think i could say that about any of my videos though Oh my god, I put my foundation on and I've been sitting here like mentally distracted for like two minutes, which means it's probably like dried down and I'm gonna have what happened to me the other day happen again, which was where everywhere that I had put my foundation, it dried down and there was just like this huge patch of foundation and I couldn't blend it out and I had to put another layer on top of it. That was the Maybelline Men Poreless and then the Revolution, blah, 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 blah. I gotta get this shit blended out. We just gotta pray. We just gotta pray that this shit will blend out because I don't, I don't know at this point. I don't even know what I was doing. What were you mentally doing for like three minutes? Like, what are you doing? Oh, it's not bad. Okay, cool. <laughs> I, I actually was a little scared. I really need to try to wash this nasty fucking brush uh or buy a new one i don't know like i haven't i feel like i haven't had it that long i've had it for less than a year and i've never washed it have i i don't know i can't recall ever washing it and i feel like it's so torn up i got it in a, a pack of brushes it's an elf brush an elf foundation brush i got it in a pack of brushes and there was like four or five of them for ten dollars so the fact that it's even held up this long is great but i it feels gross maybe i should try washing it and then if it is like if like falls apart buy a new one because i don't want to instantly just like go to buying a new one uh especially because i am i'm i'm a poor 
Yes, I know I have scraps of yesterday's makeup around my eyes. And the thing about me, bitch, is I don't care. I don't care. I like to do my makeup where I look like Uncle Fester, so it doesn't even matter. Do I care? No. Are the mites around my eyes eating well because of my lack of caring? Oh, absolutely. We keep them fed. Oh my god, I I, I, I literally just put my fucking concealer on my face and blended it out and went to tell you guys what kind it is. And then I couldn't remember if it was Rimmel or Alme. For some reason in my brain, I always think that they're the same thing and I couldn't find it. It's literally just got buried under, under my brushes that I was shifting under. I have a box of makeup right here and this fucker's been buried in it for like a week and I haven't been able to find it. It was right here in front of me in my little makeup box. Anyways, I don't know why, but I always am getting Alme and Rimmel. <laughs> mixed up and i was about to say that was my concealer and it's my alma no it's not it's my fucking room and i just it just bounced to the back of the box watch i won't find it again for another week or two i i can't keep track of time i guess one good thing about the fact by the way this is maybelline that's why i've been having trouble because this bitch is almost out this is all there's like barely any left in here that's it right there that little i'm gonna use it all i'm gonna use all of it um I'm using Maybelline Lasting Fix. The only good thing about the fact that the room is starting to heat up very badly and I'm also getting fucking powder all over my outfit that I intend to wear to my appointment today. Um, <laughs> the only good thing about it is that perhaps my, my baking powder will actually get to bake all the way down because usually it doesn't. And I try to dust it off a little too early and it ends up a little ashy. Maybe it'll actually, maybe it, maybe it'll cook a little faster. The whole point of this is to it, for it to like mix with the oils on your face. That's gross. I love it. It's wonderful. I know that people get mad at me when I call myself stupid, but guys, I've literally been struggling to get this shit out of here for a long time and never once, not once, not once, did I think to check if it was like getting low. Like, I never once thought to check if it was getting low. That's all that's left in there. Never once was, was I like, oh, I've had this for like a year. Maybe it's getting low. Not once. Not once. What the fuck is wrong with me? Everyone, always. Shay, don't call yourself stupid. Well, then why am I fucking dumb? I don't have a lot of complaints about my eyebrows right now. Uh, to be honest with you, I would like to thank Deftones and the first 14 seconds of the Cure song uh, for distracting me. <laughs> if I focus on it, I can't do it. They don't look great, but they look a whole hell of a lot better than they have looked no like lately. Like normally, I just I just rely on hats and wigs with bangs to cover up how bad it is i have a look in mind i know seconds before disaster statement from me i have a look in mind i think i'm just gonna do really thick black around my eyes and use my new lipstick that i'm in love with i'm really hungry and it's hot in here and i feel like i just need to to i feel like i need to flip my scooties up and kind of fan them out a little bit you know what it's that fucking hot in here mm. uh, i used la girl brow pomade and nyx lift and snatch on my eyebrows. Not that anybody wants to imitate them. <laughs> I'm just saying that's what I use. I'm gonna use Milani primer and then I'm gonna pack some fucking black eyes. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think if I want to put, actually I think I might put a collar underneath of it and then pack the black around the collar, but the collar is basically a, like a softer black. It's like a little bit of an off black, kind of a brownish black. I don't know how to describe it. I think I'm gonna put that down and then I'm just gonna pack black uh, around my eyes. Kind of like I did on the day when I went to my niece's birthday party. 
kind of like that. Guys, my fucking baking powder. There's only a few places that it's that she's hanging out. I I might actually turn on my my AC for this and just speed it up because it's fucking the folds of the. I just showered. I just showered, and at this point, I may as well have not even fucking showered. I'm starving and my hair is falling down. And I was like, something's missing. Something's missing here. And I couldn't figure out what the hell it was. I didn't, I put eyeshadow under my eyes, but I haven't put on any eyeliner yet. <laughs> and I wanna try to, I wanna, I wanna try now. I wanna, I wanna try now. I wanna try to put glitter on somewhere, but I don't know where. And I don't know why and I don't know how. I just really feel like I need to do more. Like I feel like I just need, that gets just, there's just not enough. You know, I have the too much gene. There's just not enough going on. My, my fucking hair is killing me. Look at it, it's falling down. And also I was watching my footage back cause I'm kind of editing as I'm going so that I can make sure that this shit gets up before we leave. How long's that been there? That G Fuel can? How long has that been there? I don't know. Uh, oh, I'm scary. I had someone tell me like two years ago that I look like something from the Mandela catalog. And you know what? I see it. I can't really comprehend the fact that I just did my mascara, which by the way, I used e.l.f. eyeliner and essence this shit. Um, it takes black stuff and it puts it around your eyes. It does a really good job on it. I can't believe I just did that shit and I didn't fucking stab myself in the eye not once. Not once did I fucking jab the shit out of myself. I saw this thing and I'm not sure if it was on um, Facebook or Instagram where it was like, is your bottom mascara aging you? Bitch, I hope. I hope. I fucking hope. I hope that it is. Eat my ass, you know? Is your being organic matter that rots aging you? <gasps> I am like 99.9999999% positive that these eyelashes don't match. But I'm gonna tell myself that it doesn't matter because... I'm wearing a lot of black eyeshadow, so you can't really tell unless you get it up on me. I... They don't look alike at all. They don't look alike at all. Ah! It's fine. We're moving pet. We're gonna move past it. You wanna hear something kind of that's breaking my heart a little bit? My skin is so fair right now because my oxygen is low and I haven't been leaving my house. And I think I look better with fair skin. I look better when I'm sick. That's kind of heartbreaking. I don't like that. I should eat. What time is it? It's one. My appointment's at four. We have to leave at three. I should eat. Also, I'm going to be using Maybelline City Bronzer with this giant fucking Wet n Wild Big Bird brush that I got at the at the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna try to be light with it. I'm gonna try to be light with it. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay, we're good. We're good. Till I get outside and see what it actually looks like. And you know what? It's none of my business. Well, how I look in my ring light. <laughs> how I look in my ring light is 
all that matters right now to me. Should I be cons- What? Why did my voice do that? Should I be- That's not a mirror. That's not a mirror. Should I be concerned about the fact that there's like a line on my face? Like I just woke up, but I didn't just wake up. I've been awake for hours. I've literally been awake since 7 a.m. Should I be concerned about the fact that there's a line on my face? <gasps> Ew. I'm wondering if it's where my cannula rests. If it's like imprinting on my face. You see what I'm talking about? What is that? <gasps> Is it, could it be from my cannula, you think? What the fuck? If you know what it is, look at it. If you know what it is, don't tell me. Cause you know what, you know what I like to do with medical issues? Ignore them until I can't anymore, okay? If it's, if I don't know about it, it's not happening. It has to be from my cannula. Cause it's like literally perfectly where it rests. Somebody's gonna be like, it's tapeworm. That goes in your stomach, doesn't it? I don't know. Don't tell me, okay? Just don't tell me. Moving on, moving on. Um, um, I think that's Epps coming home from the gym. We're using, uh, I was about to say infallible. I just used infallible to like soften up the bronzer on my face. We're using CoverGirl self, I think. Yeah, True Blend self flushed. Just a lot of it, just a lot of it. Just show a lot, a lot of it. <laughs> it feels like a heavy blush kind of day, honestly. I'm obsessed with this. It's ruining my life. I've noticed it for two minutes and it's destroying my existence. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little bit on my nose. And the way I do that, by a little bit, I mean probably too much. Just this. Uh, the other day I did my makeup on camera, my makeup on camera, <laughs> and I realized like after I was done and it was like exporting, like the video was exporting and all was said and done, like the, the deed was fucking done. The deed was done. I didn't put any highlighter on. I was like, oh bitch, how can you forget? It, 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 how can you forget? You've been using fucking highlighter for 10 years. How the hell could you have forgotten your highlighter? I don't know, but I realized like somebody's gonna point it out. Nobody said anything. Nobody was like, Shay, where's your ass load of Lottie London diamond bounds? I don't know, ask your mom. One time somebody in my comment section told me that I was like a gothic Wow, and I flagged it as misinformation because I didn't know that I, that like my dad's family has Italian in there, like genetically, you know? until I did a DNA test and had it broken down and then realized that I, that I was like over 8% Italian and I was like, sorry. But then I say your mother all the time and I'm like, maybe in another life, I was, I was roaming the streets of like New York being like, your mother. Cause I love it, I just fucking say it all the time. The answer to everything is your mom. In another life, I think I was a very short Italian man that wore a little paper boy hat and liked to run his mouth a lot. Like that bit off more than he could chew constantly. I think that was me. <sighs> Sorry, my nose started running. <clears throat> Listen, this lipstick is Revlon, Revlon. Revlon, cause I was gonna say revolution cause I use a lot of revolution. Revlon? I'm losing my fucking mind. I'm delusionally hungry <laughs> right now. It's, it's, it's Revlon Color Stay Suede Ink in the shade in the zone. It's my current favorite. I was going to try it with some black liner and then I already had it on and was like, screw it. Guys, the thought, it's 90 degrees and the thought of wearing a wig today makes me want to rip out my teeth. But also the thought of like seeing myself, catching a glimpse of myself without my wig also makes me want to rip my teeth out. I'm just gonna push through it. I did shave my legs today. 
I did my bi-monthly leg shaving and I'm gonna wear a skirt. I'm gonna see if Epps will take a picture of my outfit. He will. Like, I don't know why I'm acting like he's gonna say no. He will. I want a picture of my outfit. It's just a grumpy cat metal shirt and a black skirt, but I'm gonna wear cute shoes. All right, guys, I'm gonna end this video. Wait, I gotta put my wig on. <gasps> <laughs> I got my, I got, I got my, uh, workout for the day, um, brushing my fucking wig. Uh, I think, I think I might braid it and put on a hat. I'm not sure. 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 I'm not, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. All right, guys, I'm going to go because it's burning the fuck up in here and I'm starving and I need to make sure that this gets up before we leave and I also still have to do my nails and the fact that I don't want to flip off the camera is what <laughs> reminded me of that. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow, boy.